Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Hitbox Today with Bree. Another exciting brand new round for you. New music, new moves, new boxing combos, new hit drills, new strength. Now I want to know who's new to class. And just so you guys know, I have now my legit big screen set up so I can see your comments really big. I don't have to go like this anymore. So that means use that function today so that I can communicate with you guys. That means let me know how you're feeling. Let me know if you're loving it. Let me know if you need more music, more cues, whatever you need. I got you. As you guys know, this is a 50 minute, five zero, 50 minute format, which is exactly what we're going to follow today. It's going to be a combination of boxing drills, hit drills, and strength moves always going to get a chance to learn something on one lead combo and then do it on the other side. And I'm looking right off the bat and I want to say good morning to Sherry and Christy. Christy's ready to sweat and Sherry can't wait to start. Sherry, you are like number one. You're always on all the workouts and I just want to tell you how much I appreciate you. And I'm wearing my shirt today. Not to mention, I got two more deliveries yesterday. So I'm going to post it in my stories later on today on Instagram. You'll see some of the new Protect Your Peace and I got the rhythmic stretch. Tank two, oh my gosh. Love it, love this tank. Love this, I love this class, I love you. Thank you, Jerry. Okay guys, without further ado, I am going to hit start. And we're gonna hit the warm up song. And I think that's it. Are we good with volume, mic and music? Yes? You can always turn me up, or turn the whole volume up I should say, but I wanna make sure the music's loud. So let's get ready to rock. Set. Here we go. Just shake it out right and left. So for hitbox, what we do in the warm up is we learn all the punches on both leads. So what I want you to do right now is just pick a lead. So go to one side. And this is going to be your first lead leg. Now you're going to alternate them so it doesn't matter which one you start with. Good. And if you want to mirror me, that's maybe ideal for some of your first times because then you can really focus on matching my movement. Hello, Matthew. Give me my challenge. Love it. I love that tank so much. Okay, guys, give me your jab. So knuckles on the top. Now watch. I gotta actually remind myself that for hitbox, you don't need to move to the beat. So try to actively not go to the beat. Can you believe I have that shirt on today? Yes! Isn't that the best part? And you're gonna love it. It's easy to sweat in because it's nice and light, right? Okay, guys, so this is your jab. Now what I want you to do is take that back arm and show me the cross. So we're in that staggered stance and we will be switching leads. So whereas in kick it, we're here. Hitbox, we're turned. So your cross punch comes directly across the body and you turn that hip. Good, give me a couple more to the front. Making sure you're exhaling as you would be making contact, right? Three, two, one. Okay, let's take it hook with the front arm. Drive across. For your front arm, what I want you to do is release the heel you drive across. Abs are tight. Abs are never not tight. How about that? <laughs> okay, back arm hook. Now I drive across and I rotate again. Anytime you're coming with that back arm, you are needing more rotation in the hips and the shoulders. But guess what that equals? More power. Yes, give me a couple more here. Okay, shake it out. We got, well, one more punch, but two more sides. Front arm, show me that uppercut. Good, so what are you doing, especially in hitbox, is you're protecting your core, you're protecting in nice and tight, you're driving up. So your uppercut's gotta go more down and up. Good. You're gonna see both sides uppercuts today. So show me that back arm, drive it up. So this side, same concept, get down and up, core tight. Perfect. Couple more. Two. Shake it out. Okay. Easy enough, right? But you just picked your easier side, so switch it. Other lead now. Same punches, but now you're facing the other direction. Front arm, give me that jab. So this one, your front arm is always jabbing because the back arm's always crossing, right? So lean into it a little bit. Knuckles on top. Show me that cross. Can 
you feel that increase of power, right? Start to really start to breathe, tighten up the abs. Exhale. Good. Five, four, three, two. Shake it out. Hooks and uppercuts. Front arm, let's kick it off. Good. So big rotation. Remember, I don't need a hook that starts all the way out here. Keep your elbow nice and tight to your body and your arm just comes across at 90 degrees and drives power initiated from the hips, glutes, and core. Back arm hook. Good. More power wide. That back leg now turns. Perfect. Okay, shake it out. Let's do the uppercuts. Front arm, back arm in three, two, one. Drop the shoulder, drive up. Perfect job, you guys. Keep going. All right, try to get a little bit lower, drive up a little stronger. What you're doing is setting the foundation, right? Couple more. Three, two, back arm. Drive up. Now, as I mentioned, you're going to see it in the first combo, two uppercuts where we'll be hitting both sides. How are we feeling out there? Are you guys getting warm? Shake it out side to side. All right. Grab your jump rope. We're going to get a little cardio base, and then we're going to get to our first combo. So I want you to just start that jump rope. Good. You can also take it to heels. Or you can double time those heels. Just keep moving. And I don't want you to forget about the imaginary rope. You're not going to trip on it, but you got to move it. Come on. Core tight. Get ready. We're going to go to jet. Big reach with those arms. Jack it out. Nice work. Keep going. Arms up nice and high. How are we feeling out there, crew? Is your mindset ready to go? You know I told you to give me 10 minutes. You'll be in. We are five minutes in, so let's get ready. Keep pushing. Good. Make those arms a little bigger, of course. Always have that low impact option, yes. Three, two, one. Deep breath, let's breathe. Exhale. Deep breath. Exhale. Two more, you're ready. Exhale. Last one, please. Exhale. All right, virtual high five. We're ready. So what I want you to do is grab a sip and pay attention to your first combo. I'm going to grab a sip as well. Set with me. Here's what we got. So go back to your first lead side. Again, whichever one you choose. We're going to do the same formula for each combo. 60 seconds of a boxing move. Repeat on the other side, then we go to strength. Only kicker is you do hit twice, you do boxing twice, and we do strength for double the time, yes? Forward engaged. All right, first combo is jab, jab, shock, up, up, hook. All right, so we're going to map that out for 15 seconds, then you're going to go full out strength for 45 to complete that minute. Are you guys ready to rock? All right, practice with me for 15 seconds. Jab, jab, up. Sorry, jab, jab, cross. Up, up, hook. Front, front, back. Up, up, hook. Jab, jab, cross. Up, up, hook. Up, up, hook. Five more seconds, and we go. Say it out loud. Jab, jab, cross. Up, up, hook. Now go, full steam. Jab, jab, cross. One, two, hit. Ha, ha, ha. One, two, jump. Up, up, hook. Try to get that heart rate up. Try to speed it up without sacrificing power. Keep going. You got 30 more seconds. Now, if you want to break them into chunks, that's the first chunk. That's the second chunk. Ha, ha, hook. One, two, cross. Hit, hit, hook. Come on, 15 seconds. You should feel your muscles starting to truly shred. Yes, keep going. I'm going to fix my mic while you finish the last five seconds. Keep going. Beautiful job, team. Three, two, take a break. Take it out. All right, we're going to go into hit drill number one. Burpee plyo lunge. Take a peek. Hands, toes, in, lunge. You repeat it other side. Option. Squat, tap, squat, lunge. Then you go the other lead. Ten seconds. We got 30 seconds, then we're going to go to the other lead for box. Yes? Are you ready, 
Are you ready? Three, two, 30 seconds as fast as you can. Lunge. Lunge. Come on, guys. This is one of my favorite combos, and I'll tell you why. I'm gonna show you the options now. Because you get the benefit of going low and coming up and hitting a plyometric. Those are two surefire ways to spike that heart rate. Don't stop, don't quit. You got five more seconds. Breathe. Three, two, good beat. Step touch. Yes. Catch your breath. Good. I'll give you a little chance to kind of gather yourself before we move on, but I will push us. Break some minimal today. Boxer shuffle when you're ready. Okay, turn to the other lead side. You know everything we're gonna do now. We're just repeating on the other side. Deal? How'd we do? All right, get ready to mark it. Looks like this. Jab, jab, cross. Up, up, hook. Jab, jab, cross. Up, up, hook. Use your abs. I'm accentuating it a little bit more. Keep going, you guys. Five more seconds. Jab, jab, cross. Up, up, hook. Three, two, go. 45 seconds. Jab, jab, cross. Hook. Jab, jab, cross. Up, up, hook. Up, cross, knee, 
push back front. I'll do it again. Power upper, power cross, knee push back front. So the knee's gonna set you up once, then it's full out kick. Yes? Okay, couple seconds. We're gonna do that for 15. Then I'm gonna say go, we go all out. Ready? Here we go. Up, cross, knee, push. My bad, you gotta set it up. I'm just too excited. Up, cross, knee, push, back, front, up, cross, knee, push, back. Go for it, guys. Up, cross. Push him, push him, push him, set, up, cross, knee, push, 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 set. Come on. Guess what? When you get tired, you are literally probably always 15 or seconds, 15 or 20 seconds away. That's the case right now. 15 more seconds. Let's see it. Why do you feel that? That is your energy system starting to max out and going, help. Pushing to get stronger. Shake it out. Good. That's why HIT training is shorter durations with a recovery. Because we're staying in that anaerobic phase as long as we can. Kickboxing, kick it, mostly aerobic with a little hit. Are you guys ready for your next hit drill? Speaking of. Yes or yes? Okay, calm down. You still have, I'm watching the clock. You still have five seconds. Here's what we got. You're gonna jack your feet and alternate your taps or just tap out. I'm gonna give you a couple more seconds because I wanna hit that strong 30. So here's your second option. You can also tap shoulder, tap shoulder. Otherwise you hop at the same time. 30 seconds, go. The challenge in hopping at the same time versus alternating. You can even alternate and tap same time. It's all about how tight you can keep your core so you can protect yourself and stay stable. 10 more seconds, you choose. Come on, you're almost there. Come on, I'm right next to you. I am your coach here to push you across that line. Time, check it out. Yes. I'll tell you something, guys. Every time you feel that resistance that starts in your mind, right? Every time you tell it, you are building confidence in yourself. And that's going to be huge. So really commit to accepting, embracing challenge, whether it's exercise or anything in life, you will slowly start to get stronger and stronger mentally over time. Ready? Up, cross, knee, push, back, kick. Try it. Up, cross, knee, push, back, front. Couple more. Last one, we're gonna go full out after this. You ready? Go, up, cross, knee, push, back, front, up, cross. <laughs> Think of it as three parts, two parts. Up, cross, knee, then kick, kick, kick. <laughs> Look where you kick. Look behind you. You are almost there. Come on, you can do this. Guess what? 15 seconds, you got it. Up, cross, knee, push, push, push. Keep going, keep going. Almost there, almost there. And time, check it out. Oh man, good work you guys. We're gonna move on. Another set of that hit drill, are you ready to rock? Oh man, new track's coming in. It knows you need the energy, right? I'll give you a couple more seconds, come down. How we feeling? Matthew loves burpees. I know, you're good. Ready? Come down. 30 seconds. Go! Four. I actually really like the tap at the same time. If that's too much, then you alternate. You essentially have three options. You might be at one today. You do this a few times. You're at the next one two weeks from now, so on and so forth. Go between each layer. Five more seconds, crew. I pop up so I can be right there with you, right next to you for your last two. One, done. Stand up. Yes. 
step, touch and shake it out with me. How are we feeling? We good? Yes, I love that I can see comments perfectly up and clear. It's great. Okay, next is our next set of strength moves. You still have a few seconds to recover. Okay, this is gonna be fun. You're gonna do 45 seconds each leg. So you're gonna pick a lead leg. You're gonna do a single leg squat while throwing off your balance in all three directions. Front, side, back. Now, you can also bend your knee if you wanna go a little bit deeper. The side one you don't really need to, right? Who's gonna go all the way down to the ground on the side one, that's a challenging one. But on the way back, you can also lift your foot and tap. So straight leg or knee bent, higher the knee, the harder the balance. Are you ready? Pick that first leg. We're gonna do a quick switch. 45 seconds each side. Three, two, one, let's go. Front squat, lateral, reverse. Or you can simply just tap the heel, tap the toe, tap the toe, right? You got a lot of options here. What we're essentially doing is throwing our center of gravity for a loop. And all of your muscles have to tighten and quickly shift to get in position. This is super functional, you guys. You're almost there. 10 more seconds. We're gonna quick switch to the other lead without a break. You can do it. This side is fresh. Ready? Three, two, one. Switch lead legs. Same thing. Squat. Squat. I like to reach on the front one for sure. Now you can lift. I love this song. It sounds so futuristic and it's got a really deep beat so you can really push. Do you agree? Do you feel it? Does it instantly make you want to step your game up? That's what it's all about, you guys. The moves, the music, and me, I hope, is pushing you to reach your best self. You're almost there. You got 15 seconds. Yes. Forget motivation. You got your motivation. I'm Just show up. That's I'm it. Just put your schedule. Make it a habit. Done. Step touch. Beautiful job. All right. We're going to go into block three now. We got a third combo. This one, I have a feeling, my ticket fans, you're going to love. First, go grab a sip. And I shouldn't actually limit to that. Everyone's going to love it. But if you take ticket, you know how much I love roundhouses. All right. Here comes our song. Here we go. In case you wonder why YouTube songs are so different, I use royalty-free music that I actually mix and pick the speeds and all that jazz. That's why it's different. IG will always have a different sound. That's just the why. Okay, guys. Easy combo to start. Jab, cross, hook, up. Then you're gonna take that back leg. You're gonna knee sweep open, slap. Yes? So practice. Jab, cross, hook, up. Sweep it, slap it. Excuse me, sweep it, slap it. Let's turn that over. <laughs> it's alternating. Jab, cross, hook, up. Open up, slap. That feels better. Jab, cross, hook, up. Open up, slap. Notice my toe on the alternating side is turned out for more stability. Couple seconds we go. Jab, cross, hook, up. Sweep, go strong. 45. <laughs> Sweep, slap, jab, cross, hook, up. Sweep, slap. This one, my favorite. Ha, 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 ha. Hey, hey. Uh, yes. I want you to dig deep because everybody's got that alter ego deep down inside. Pull it out. This is your fight scene. Show them who came to play. 10 more seconds, team. Come on. You're almost there. Make sure that roundhouse toe is out. Open your hip. Slap with your laces. Three, two, one, done. Okay. That one probably got you a little winded. Good. We're going to now go a little bit more on that winded side and do another hip drill. We're going to go high, low, high, low, tap, jump. You can also high, low, high, low, tap, jump, low impact. Bend your knees, bend your knees, tap, raise it up. Okay, 15 seconds. 
focus. We're going to go 30 on. You ready? Jump big if you can. Otherwise, remove the jump and sit low. Perfect. You ready to rock? Three, two, one. Hit it. Let's go. Jump, jump, tap, up. When you finish the down, you follow that high, low, then you jump up center. Come on. Keep pushing. Low impact. I'm down. I raise up on my calves, on my toes. Squeeze my calves. Come on. You guys are almost there. These are the seconds that count. Ten more seconds, you're going to get a chance to walk around your space. Keep going. Five more. High. High. Jump. And done. Step touch. Woo! Okay, serious business today. You didn't know you were signing up for some serious, serious calorie smash, right? Okay, grab a sip in between. I keep moving it on myself. Keeping myself on my toes. Okay, we're going to that other lead leg. Who's ready? Did you all jump out and say, I am free, let's go. Okay, so take that other lead forward. Three, two, we're gonna mark it. Jab, cross, hook up. Jab, cross, hook up. Sweep, slap. Jab, cross, hook up. Sweep, slap. Jab, cross, hook up. Sweep, slap. Yes. Go, 45. Sweep, slap. Jab, cross, hook up. Sweep, slap. Because you finished here, that's why we open. Attack. Sweep. Slap, 30 seconds. Come on. Hey, hey. Ha, 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 ha. Sweep. Slap. Go big, guys. Right now is that sweep. 15 seconds left. Sweep. Slap. Yes. When you feel that part where your body is just starting to run out of energy, your muscles feel shredded, go hard. Come on. And time. That one came on, I was like, oh, heck yes. Ready to rumble, yes? All right, shake it out for me. We have our third hit drill. We're gonna go other lead to start. High, low, tap, and jump. What I was mentioning was, you're down here for the low, that's where you go all the way down and jump up. Five seconds. Breathe. Ready, team? Go. High, low, high, tap, jump. High, low, high, low. Come on, make those work. Make those legs do the work for you. Low impact. My legs are still working because I'm driving lower into my squat. You're almost there, you got 10 more seconds. Come on, where are we at, guys? Push your body. Tap, jump, two, one, done. Okay. Just curious where your heart rate's at. I'll give you guys a peek at mine. So, with me stopping, mine was at 140, which is still a pretty good rate, right? You really shouldn't be able to hold that for that whole time. You should be maxing out. You're probably a little higher. Okay, catch your breath. That's the purpose. So while you're breathing, I'm just gonna explain a little bit more of the science, because I mentioned before, there's a lot of science behind what I programmed. What we're doing today, working on boxing, challenging that anaerobic system to go to 45 seconds. Take a small break. Then we go, all right, hit drill 30 seconds. Then we break, we go to strength. Yes? 150, Christy, that's good. Awesome job. Okay, strength is up now. For the first 30 seconds, you're gonna come down. You're gonna do a tricep push-up to a down dog. Then you're gonna jump up for a squat sequence. Yeah? Okay, come on down. I wanted your heart rate to be a little bit more recovered, so you should be there now. Take a peek. Tricep, push. Tricep, push. Now the push is strategic because I want it to be that little bit of break you need to do this whole set on your toes. It's only 30 seconds. Your best. Yes, Sherry 149. I love that. You guys are pushing. Ready? Tricep down dog. Let's go. I am totally fine if you go to knees. But try, guys. 
just dip your toe in the water on that regular toe only tricep push up. I'm watching the time because you're not doing it for a full minute. Don't worry. We will grow to that this year. Yes, we will. We got a couple more seconds and I want you to jump up. Yes. Three, two, one. Now make your way up. 15 seconds before we start. Take a peek at what I got. Narrow, wide, widest, and you come back in. We're staying low the entire 30 seconds. Traveling out, I want you to pay attention to where you feel it. Ready? Let's go. Squat, 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 in the other side. Feel the muscles change in your quads. Also, you can also feel the glutes, am I right? Yes, you got 15 more seconds. Stay low. Push, push, push. Come on, you're almost there. Keep pushing. You have three, two, one, done. Come and stand. Step up. All right, this is the point of class where we are going to go and take more of those moves that you've seen the whole time and run them back to back. So we take the boxing out. We are actually going to go into strength first. Totally push our muscles a little bit further. Then go to hit and then always end with four. So take it out. Do you remember the first move? We're going to walk out. We're going to do two push-ups. We're going to come back. Two squat kicks. We are going to run every move. Today. We have done 30 in the past. But we're going to push a little bit harder. Except for the end. We'll stay with those 30 30s. Are you guys ready? Walk out, push up, let's go. All the way out. Two push ups. Come back. Squat kick. You focus on just executing with good form, listening to my cues. I am your timer. I am your coach. I am your cheerleader. So don't worry about anything else. All I want you to do is focus on how you feel and how you can make every move that much better. Form a little tighter. Good, you got about 12 seconds left. The strength, as always, is full body. Four seconds, we transition. Ready? Come on up, because we're taking our time going from low to high. We got a couple seconds to watch. Pick that leg up. Ready? 45 seconds, each direction. Nothing changes with this one. Ready, and let's go. Squat, lateral, reach. Keep going on this lead. Because you've been here before, see if you can speed it up. Just a little bit, but this isn't hit. Don't get confused. You still want to have really good control. I'm just always asking you to push yourself between speed and form. 15 seconds. If you haven't done a squat sequence like this before, get ready to feel muscles that you might have not felt in a while. Promise me you're supporting your knee. You can always take the heel down for extra support. Quick switch. Other lead right away. Good. One benefit of minimal break is that we can actually maintain a pretty solid heart rate even on strength. Only program that way when it's back to back different sides. Because then you're not sacrificing the next muscle. It's recovered, it's ready. Yes? How are we feeling out there? 20 seconds. Woo! Keep going. Perfect. Don't worry, I'm watching. I got my own clock right behind me, so that I don't have to look away. I can look at you and look at it. And we're good. Okay, come down. Tricep push up, down dog. 30 seconds. Stretch your chest. Let's get ready. I love that part. Okay, tricep push up. And let's go. 30. Up. We're going to go into that squat. 
Rock combo one more time, last time. Almost there, team. I'm watching for you in five, four, three, two. Come on up, I'm gonna give you a couple seconds, then we go. Ready? Just take a preview before we start. Narrow, regular, wide, all the way back in, right into the narrow. Sit low, 30 seconds, and get tight, support your back, go. If you need a break, come up in between. Yes, otherwise, sink, 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 right back to the other side. Do you feel glutes, glutes, and quads, and hamstrings? Yes. If you follow some of the workouts that I've done where I showed you how to open your hip flexors, and especially today, we're going to focus on how to stretch there, that's going to be your key. Keep going. You're almost there. Three, two, one, done. Come up. All right. We're going to get another beat on because this is way too mellow. We're going to go to a little Tabata with our cardio. Are you guys ready? Tabata. And actually, I'm going to take it to. Here we go. So, next is up. We are going to do all of those hit box drills. Six sets, 20 on, 10 off. Shake it out. Then we're going to finish today's amazing lineup with four. <laughs> Get ready. Our first move is burpee plyo lunge. Ready, go. That was quick, but you can jump in. I don't want to waste any time. I want to keep us going. We got to save the maximum time for abs and our cool down. You got 10 more seconds, team. You're almost there. Come on, come on. Push. Three, two, one. Shake it out. Good. Your next set, plank, shoulder tap. Come on down and get ready. 20 seconds in. Three, two, one, go. 20 seconds. Or we tap. Yes. Time. Jump up. All right. Next. High, low, high, low. Tap the floor. Jump. This is going to complete one round through. We do it again. We go to abs. Ready? Go. 20 seconds. High, low. High, low. Tap. Jump. High, low. High, low. Tap. Jump. Push. You can also absolutely keep it low impact. We're almost there. Come on. I know you're tired. You should be tired at this point. So don't get down on yourself. That's the point. That's the goal. Break. Okay. Step touch. Burpee plyo lunge. One more round of each. That's it. You guys ready? Go. Burpee lunge. All the way down. Make sure you land soft. What's that option, team? You remember? Yes. Squat. Lunge. You can tap or you go right into that lunge. You're almost there. In three, two, one, done. Step touch. All right, we gotta make our way down. Plank taps. Ready? Three second heads up. And go. Right now, as you're staring down, because I don't want you looking at me, I want you looking at the floor, I want you to get your goal front and center, right in your mind. Like, why are you here? Besides feeling amazing, because that's a given. Dig deep. Lock eyes on your Y. That's going to help you push these last three, two, one. Stand up. Nice. Step touch. Okay, final set. High, low, high, low. Tap. Jump. When you jump this time, give me a high five. Go. High five. Boom. High. High. Tap. Boom. Come on. I want those air high fives. And I am growing to about seven five. So you got to jump up and give me that big high five at the top. You're almost there. Four seconds, guys. Push, push. And done. All right. Don't stop moving yet. Beautiful work. We always save the best for last because I love abs. I know everyone probably does this too. But here's the other reason we do abs last. You need your core for this entire workout. So I never want to tire you out too soon. But we can do it now at the end where we can slow the pace. Inhale. And recover. I said slow the pace. I did not say slow the music. Good. Grab a sip. Come right back out. You guys are doing so good. If you happen to walk by, let me know how you're feeling. 
And let's pick what song we want to end with. With the out, I should say. Not completely. You ready? Right 
control if you want to go real control. Four. Yes, dig. Five. Four tight. Six. You can even feel your lats contract, yes? Seven. Give me two more. Wherever you're at. Two, whichever level. One. Flip around. Good. I like to go Cobra first. After we do those ab sets. Good child's pose. All right, 15 second heads up before our last one. Flip around. Last and final set. Also, don't wait for me. You guys can do this anytime you want. Maybe this weekend. Try a couple, another three sets of 10. Here we go. Fight for that form. Keep going. Just for the sake of me not muscling my mic, I'm going to come in close. And I'm going to make sure that you guys have the support of me as your coach right here. Now, look at these final cues. Because on your last set, it can get challenging. And you might start to let that form fall. So right now, head to toe. Relax your shoulders away from your ears. But lift your chest. Good. Get out of the low back. Pull your lower abdominals in tight. Use your breath to drive up with a lot of power. Take your time. Get that last chest lift. You probably have a couple more. Last one. You made it. All right. Relax. Go ahead and take your time coming up. If you want to give a couple cobra, a couple child's pose stretches. We got three minutes to stretch our bodies. Let's get ready. Go ahead and jump up. Beautiful job today, you guys. I cannot say enough about how hard I know each and every one of you work. So I see you, I commend you, and I appreciate you. All right, go ahead and come up, grab a sip if you want. Deep breath in.
please let me know in the comments if I didn't get to see you live how you did if you dropped by and all of you guys that I am seeing live I appreciate you thank you for joining me and 